Assalamualaikum everyone. You're welcome to our YouTube channel. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can share files using WeTransfer.com. WeTransfer.com gives you an option to either create a user account where you can log in, share your files and have access to other facilities, or you can simply share a file without you having to create an account. And so in this clip, I will guide you through the process of sharing files without you creating a user account. Okay, so what you simply do is this. Um, you go to your web browser and then you type the web address, which is wetransfer.com, like we have it here uh, on the address bar. Once um, you submit and it loads up, the landing page is like what you see here, you see appearing right here. So it tells you that WeTransfer is the simplest way to send your files around the world. Uh, then gives you a button asking a question, send the file. So to begin, we are going to tap send the file or send the file. So we'll tap there and then it loads up, it gives us an upload page. The upload page has a plus uh, button uh, with a description at your files. Now we can upload up to two um, um, gig size of files, of any files that we choose to do so. So um, we'll tap on the plus button. So we we'll tap and then it loads up and takes us to where we can choose our files. There are four options or there are four um, uh, locations where we can take our files from. From Starting from the left, um, there is a camera button where we can take live photograph of, uh, of anything and then we'll upload. We can also do the same from camcorder, either photograph or, or, or a video. You can as well record sound using the sound recorder and upload or we can go to documents and select any uh, pre-recorded uh, file which could be a pdf file it can be a, a word document it can be an image it can be a video or it can be an audio file so for this tutorial uh, we're going to use the camera option so i uh, would we'll simply tap on my camera and then the camera opens up fine then I'm going to take a photograph of this, my friend that is sitting on my size too. So I tap, I snap this, my friend, and then I tap on the tick, it sets it up. Now, uh, the file has been um, loaded to the wetransfer.com, and then wetransfer.com actually gives us a default, it gives the file a default, a default name, uh, and then rates the size of the file with the, bot or with the text button where we can describe what a file is and on the message so i want to say that um, this is my friend friend teddy so that's how i want to describe um, my photograph and then i'm okay with that so i can tap on next and then it loads up and once uh, i tap on next it takes me to um, another page with two options so I can send this file via an email or I can generate a link and then share the file uh, through the link so for this tutorial I want to get the link I want to send a link uh, to someone and a person on accessing the link will have access to the photograph of my friend so I tap on transfer okay um, on tap on transfer the file uh, begins to be transferred this will count from 0% to 100% depending on the strength of your network connection so the speed will depend on that so for me you can see that mine is counting and then the size of the data um, that is being um, uploaded is being counted so I will need to be patient if for any reason I want to step back, I can tap on cancel. Cancel will cancel the transfer and takes me backward. So I can uh, upload a new file and then send. Okay. 
So for this tutorial, let's just keep watching. Let it count up to 100%. It's about to get to 100%. It's already 94% as we can see. Okay. And then here we go. 99%, 100. All right. So on getting to 100, once the upload is complete, you see that it will take us to, um, and it, uh, to a pitch that we like so much. Let's just watch. Fine. It tells you you are done. Okay, so since our interest is on getting a link, you can see the link listed there on the box. HTTPS, you see uh, the codes that make up the link. So we are going to copy this link and then I can send this link to anyone either through WhatsApp, through Facebook, through email address or whatever means I want to share the link. So on, uh, in, in, anyone that has access to this link can access the photograph of my friend that I just took. So I tap on copy link. Okay. On tapping on copy link, you can see that the link has been highlighted. So the link now is on my clipboard so I can share it. I can paste it anywhere. Yes, that's how it is. That is how simple it is to share a file using wetransfer.com. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial. If you have, please like our videos, um, share with friends, uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and then um, enable the notification button so that you can always get to know when new contents are uploaded. Thank you.